Russell Brand accused of sexual assault on movie set in new lawsuit. Russell Brand, the British star, is facing yet another accusation of sexual assault. A new lawsuit has been filed against him in the New York Supreme Court by a woman referred to as Jane Doe. This comes just six weeks after Brand was accused by four women of sexual assault in a Channel 4 documentary and The Times and Sunday Times newspapers. The alleged incident took place on the set of the movie Arthur in 2010. According to the affidavit filed in the case, Brand appeared intoxicated and smelled of alcohol while carrying a bottle of vodka on set. The court papers also claim that Brand exposed his penis to the victim in full view of the cast and crew. The lawsuit accuses Brand of sexually assaulting the woman in the bathroom, with a member of the production crew guarding the door from outside. The victim states that she suffered extreme embarrassment, shame, and fear as a result of the abuse. She is requesting to sue anonymously, as she still works in the entertainment industry and fears reprisals. In addition to Brand, distributor Warner Brothers Pictures and other companies involved in the movie's production have been named as defendants in the case. They are accused of negligence and aiding and abetting Brand by tolerating his behavior on set. This lawsuit was brought under the state's Adult Survivors Act, which allows alleged victims one year to sue over historic sexual abuse, even if the statutes of limitations have already passed. Brand has denied all the allegations made against him, and British police are currently investigating the claims. This is the first lawsuit to be brought against him in court. The victim's affidavit expresses concern that her identity becoming known publicly in relation to this sexual abuse claim would worsen her feelings of embarrassment, shame, and fear, leading to irreparable harm to her mental health. Brand, who has largely stopped appearing in mainstream media, has built up a large online following with conspiracy theory videos and anti-establishment takes. Following the initial allegations against him, YouTube announced it was stopping him from making money from his 6.6 .6 million subscribers, and he moved his live videos over to the Rumble platform.